Exactly as Elon Musk revealed, Tesla will finally launch Optimus Gen 3 by the end of this year with incredible improvements, especially in its tasks, making it extremely useful. There's no debate that Musk once compared Optimus to a real-life version of C-3PO from Star Wars. But that's not even the biggest surprise he recently unveiled about Tesla's humanoid robot. With a production cost of just $10,000, or even less, Tesla could manufacture thousands of these robots for factory operations in the initial phase and scale up to 100 times that number within a year. These staggering figures hint at when we might finally be able to purchase an Optimus robot. And welcome to Techno Creators. Before we begin, please help us reach 4,500 subscribers. It will be a huge motivation for us to continue bringing you great tech episodes. All the healthcare and daily life tasks that Tesla Optimus can perform sound amazing. However, we bet that very few people truly believe or expect that robots can actually achieve these capabilities just yet. Will they require user control? How much will it cost to own one? And of course, many more questions still need answers. First, when it comes to the tasks that Tesla Optimus can perform, there's no need to worry. This robot will be capable of handling any job assigned to it after undergoing rigorous testing and learning in laboratories. Millions of videos are being uploaded to help Optimus acquire operational knowledge. Most tasks that people assume robots can't replace humans for are actually within Optimus's capabilities. Tesla has prioritized healthcare and daily life assistance from the very beginning. When Tesla released footage of Optimus helping families by watering plants, carrying items, and working in the kitchen, it was clear what the company's main focus was. With a completely unique hand design compared to other robots on the market, Tesla Optimus confidently features 22 degrees of freedom in its hands. However, within just a year, Optimus could be upgraded to 25 degrees of freedom, bringing it closer to the human hand, which has 27 degrees of freedom. The new hand design also reveals an impressive waterproof capability, fully encased in a premium silicone coating to prevent rust in the joints and extend the lifespan of internal components. This design could be expanded to the leg joints, enhancing Optimus's ability to walk in wet environments or perform flood rescue missions. The combination of strength and flexible dexterity will give Optimus a significant edge over every other humanoid robot on the market. This represents Tesla's incredibly important commitment to bringing Optimus into the lives of every family on the planet. Next, Tesla's repeated confirmation that Optimus is still remotely controlled has left many people confused, with the biggest question being, will it be autonomous when released to the market? From our perspective, a humanoid robot wouldn't be truly useful if you had to manually program every single action. This means that when you buy an Optimus, you might need to train it from scratch and guide it through tasks, which could be quite time-consuming, right? However, remote control for Optimus is only being used to accelerate research and improve its capabilities faster. AI models typically require vast amounts of data for training, but the Tesla bot doesn't need to undergo this process in the same way. If you show the robot enough examples, it will be able to perform tasks it hasn't been explicitly trained for. As Elon Musk mentioned, you just need to show it a video and it will be able to perform the task. As seen in recent footage, Optimus is now navigating areas it has never been to before. It moves continuously without bumping into anything, meaning it can explore its surroundings. Essentially, it operates similarly to Tesla's full self-driving system. You just give it a command. And even if it has never seen that path before, it still knows how to move safely. This FSD-based technology is particularly well-suited for unfamiliar environments like the surface of Mars. The robot's camera system scans the terrain and then navigates it just as it is demonstrated in footage of Optimus climbing steep landscapes. If we observe how Optimus moves, we can still see some wobbling in its gait. The Tesla team is likely working on refining this to make its movements faster and smoother. However, what truly stands out is the latest update Tesla just released, showcasing Optimus's impressive ability to climb stairs, something we hadn't seen before. While many other robots on the market have this capability, 
it highlights Tesla's rapid progress. Increasing both speed and mobility at the same time is no easy task, as it requires significant hardware upgrades. The hardware includes components such as batteries, motors, actuators, wiring, and sensors, all of which directly impact the strength and balance of the robot's legs. Therefore, improving speed means Tesla must also innovate and enhance these critical elements. Additionally, because Tesla is still focused on vehicle production, they cannot allocate their full efforts solely to Optimus. However, the frequent updates being released prove that Elon Musk is genuinely committed to the humanoid robot project. Could Optimus develop consciousness on its own? To introduce its new design, Tesla's Optimus robot successfully played tennis in midair with 100% accuracy, completing the task on the second try. This demonstration, however, was conducted remotely in Tesla's lab. Elon Musk and his engineers mentioned that the demo gave the team confidence that the new hand design could be integrated into the next larger version of Optimus. Furthermore, Tesla engineers are working on expanding tactile sensors with a larger surface area, fine-tuning small tendon control buttons, and reducing the weight of the forearm. Earlier, the Gen 3 hand was unveiled at Tesla's Wii Robot event in October, which also featured the highly anticipated RoboTaxi. The hand in the latest demo was more refined, with multiple layers making it appear more human-like. Engineer Kovic explained that they are exploring ways to balance the softness of the protective layers on the fingers and palm without impacting the tactile sensors. In an industrial setting, Tesla released footage of Optimus moving battery cells and performing tasks at its Gigafactory. With improved dexterity, the Tesla bot is capable of handling complex assembly tasks, moving items, delicately handling fragile objects, and performing repetitive tasks on production lines. In a recent demonstration, Optimus successfully assembled parts on the automotive production line, matching human workers' speed and precision. It uses advanced vision systems to identify parts and complete tasks seamlessly. Additionally, the robot displayed its ability to recognize and correct errors during assembly, a skill usually found in human workers. This error correction feature enhances the robot's reliability in high-risk industrial environments. Tesla intends to start limited production of Optimus next year, with full-scale manufacturing expected by 2026. The robots are expected to cost around $20,000, making them suitable for a wide range of applications. This progress highlights Tesla's dedication to advancing robotics and AI, positioning Optimus as a versatile solution for future automation. Optimus has also demonstrated its capability in performing various household tasks, such as watering plants, folding clothes, and even helping in the kitchen. Its dexterous hands with 22 degrees of freedom allow it to handle delicate items like eggs without breaking them, exhibiting the same precision as human hands. Tesla Optimus is designed to interact with children, assist the elderly, and even take on tasks like babysitting and dog walking. This versatility underlines Optimus's potential to become an essential part of everyday life, offering both practical help and companionship. With 28 structural actuators, Optimus has a range of motion similar to humans. This design allows it to navigate complex environments, maintain balance, and complete tasks requiring high mobility. Additionally, Optimus uses the same AI system developed for Tesla's self-driving cars, allowing it to process large amounts of real-time data and adapt to new tasks and environments. Tesla's Optimus robot has also proven capable of walking on uneven debris-filled terrain by using neural networks to control its limbs, showing its ability to balance and adapt even without visual input. Lastly, Optimus has demonstrated progress in playing tennis with the new hand design, completing tasks autonomously with skill and precision. So you could say pick up a cup, pick up a shirt, fold the shirt. Uh, th these, these things will generalize, I think, quite quickly. Um, While it may still be too early to discuss Optimus's potential as a household assistant, especially since Musk has confirmed that customers and businesses will be able to buy it by 2026, this timeline seems reasonable. In 2024 and 2025, the limited units 
will mainly be used for internal purposes and research at the factory. However, it's important to highlight that a rental program will be available before Tesla starts selling Optimus. This will give more customers the chance to try it out before making a purchase decision. This also serves as a strategic move by Tesla to gradually enhance Optimus with more features. Recently, discussions around the Tesla Model 2 have once again erupted. Elon Musk recently revealed that the Tesla Model 2, or possibly the Model Q, will be launched in the first quarter of 2025. Despite rumors of cancellation, the Model 2 is expected to be the most compact, stylish, and capable car you can buy at this price point. As of now, based on the latest production updates, a price under $20,000 seems feasible, and the car is likely to have two versions. The Tesla Model 2 is one of the most highly anticipated yet elusive vehicles in the electric car world. First revealed in 2020, Elon Musk hinted at a mass-market car priced at $25,000, with leaks suggesting a launch date in early 2025. However, rumors of cancellation, due to Tesla focusing on self-driving technology, left fans uncertain. Now the wait is almost over. Tesla has confirmed that the Model 2 will launch in the first half of 2026 and is shaping up to be a game-changer. The Model 2 is designed to make a significant impact in the affordable electric vehicle market, especially in China where it will compete with the BYD Dolphin and Volkswagen ID3. Tesla plans to offer the product at an extremely low price of $21,800, a figure unprecedented for a Tesla-branded electric car. To achieve this, Tesla has dramatically reduced production costs, targeting a 50% reduction from the 33,600 production cost of the Model 3. This brings the expected production cost down to around 16,800 while still ensuring high profitability. With a 30% profit margin per vehicle, applying this margin to the reduced production costs means the Model 2 could retail for around $22,000, a great deal for consumers and a cash cow for Tesla. With millions of units expected to roll off the production line, Tesla is in a position to make massive profits while still keeping the price affordable for the average consumer. Even more interesting, is the rumor that Tesla will shift the production of lithium iron phosphate batteries for the Model 2 to the United States. This move would create jobs and unlock significant federal subsidies, potentially making the Model 2 even more profitable. With an expected profit of $10,000 per vehicle, Tesla could quickly recoup its investment, especially as production scales up. As mentioned earlier, the Model 2 is likely to be a scaled-down version of the Model 3, about 20% smaller, and a compact crossover, as Tesla employees hinted earlier this year. A prototype leaked at Giga Berlin earlier this year gave us a glimpse of it, coming shortly after Musk announced that the European factory would also produce the Model 2. We once thought that this car would look quite modern and inherit many futuristic design elements, but given the current timeline, that seems a bit far-fetched. If there's anything new in the design of the Model 2, the light bar is the only feature we think might be included. Tesla has gradually incorporated this element into its new models, including the Cybertruck, Cybercab, and Model Y Juniper. Additionally, don't expect too much from the design of the Model 2. The interior will be similar. Aside from possibly accommodating four to five seats, don't expect features like heated seats, LED lighting, or rear passenger screen. Yes, don't expect much. To achieve maximum minimalism for the Model 2, Tesla has also developed a unique motor for the vehicle, eliminating rare earth materials and priced at just $1,000. Furthermore, Tesla is said to have dismantled a $24,000 Honda Civic to understand how Honda produces affordable cars without sacrificing quality and performance, according to company employees. Connecting this information, we can somewhat guess which cost-saving features Tesla and Elon Musk will integrate into the Model 2 to achieve the dream production price of $25,000. Tesla does not have experience in producing low-cost cars. They've always integrated expensive features into their vehicles. With the Model 2, the main challenge lies in its affordability. A $25,000 price tag doesn't mean Tesla will carelessly use cheap, low-quality materials inside. It won't be like that. Everything will be geared toward balance and simplification compared to the more expensive models. However, the price of the Model 2 could even drop to as low as $20,000 if it truly has lower performance, 
possibly due to the 50 kilowatt hour lithium iron phosphate battery. The Model 2 is expected to use LFP batteries from CATL, a type of battery particularly suited for affordable cars. This type of battery is known for being the cheapest, safest, and capable of fast charging, but with limited energy capacity. We believe that with the Tesla Model 2, Elon Musk may have to sacrifice some of the specifications and features the company is currently famous for just to produce this vehicle. Now, let's talk about the range of the Model 2. If you think the Model 2 could still achieve a range of 250 to 300 miles, we believe this is unlikely, as another trade-off for the Model 2 could be the range when charging. What do you think about this? Feel free to share your thoughts in the comments section below. We hope to bring the best information to you. Please give a thumbs up if you like this. Join Techno Creator by subscribing and hit the bell icon so you will not miss out on any awesome videos. We value your feedback. Thanks for watching. Until then, stay safe and have fun.